the Madison Square Garden Lowdown for MSG Varsity. The Knicks, the Rangers, right here at WHITradio.org. All right, it's Sam the Man. That's uh, Sneaky Steven. And it's, it's, uh, it's Bring Your Kids to Work Day, so I decided to bring my son, Ratchet Richie. Uh, say Richard. hi, son. He's going to be on the show. We're going to be debating oh, some son, NBA playoffs. Ratchet Richie here. Yeah, rat, that's Ratchet Richie. Ratchet Richie. All right, uh, first off, I want to just say the NBA Pacers are going to win the uh, NBA Finals. Are you serious right now? Yeah. First of all, the Pacers, like, look. They're Pacers, dominant right now. They, they're dominant against the Knicks. Nobody's going to box out Roy Hibbert. Nobody. If they beat the on Knicks. On Miami? If they beat the Knicks. And they get to Miami, nobody's boxing him out in Miami. Yeah. Yes, they have Chris Anderson who's He can't box playing. out Roy Hibbert. If Tyson Chandler can't do it, what makes you think that uh, Chris Anderson can do it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, I give you that, but if David I, West, I, I don't see it happening. David West, da- if David West sticks LeBron James, LeBron James is not going to be able to score as much. Yeah. Are you kidding David me? West is a great defensive player. Yeah, he's a great defensive player. And he's been shutting down Carmelo. He's the greatest. All right, Carmelo Anthony. Carmelo Anthony, who scored LeBron, more LeBron than LeBron James. LeBron James is a better offensive player than Carmelo Anthony. He scored more. Who scores more, Carmelo or uh, LeBron mm-hmm. James? LeBron James. I mean, Carmelo Anthony, Exactly. Exactly. But, but offensively, it's not just scoring. Yes, it is. No, it's not. All right, he okay, passed what's, it. Okay, what's the he point of it. offense then? You're going to say Magic Johnson nah. wasn't a great <laughs> offensive player. He was. He also scored. All right, scored. but did he, he score scored. a yes, lot, a lot of points? He scored, though. He, he scored. did score. Yeah. LeBron scored, scored, then Magic scored. He scored, then, wait, what'd you say? LeBron James right now scored more than Magic Johnson did. That's true, but David West is going to shut him down. If you shut David the, West if is you not play good, How do you know that? If you David play, West if isn't. You LeBron good, James is one of the four unguardable play, players in the league right now. According to you. He really is one according of the According to you. Guard. You could ask him anybody. According he's to unguardable. you. According to you. Okay, he's according to me, he's unguardable. According to you. Yes. I think David West can do it according to me. Well, we're going to have to wait and see. Yeah. And I wouldn't I wouldn't count the Knicks yet. Not yet. And if they if the Indiana Pacers No, I'm, I'm counting out the Knicks. I if the Indiana, I think if, if the there's Indiana one Pacers, team that can make a 3-1 and come back. I, I think New York. Right they're going now. back to New York. They're going. No. They're going back to Madison not, Square Garden. They're, they're, they're if they win in Madison Square they're Garden, defeated. they're down three two. They're, they're down de- three two. They're they're defeated. They're think, a defeated team. They're down three one. They're de- yeah. They're yeah, down they're three, down three one. one. I'm saying exactly. if they go back to Madison Square Garden, no, they're not going to win in Madison. How do you know? Because they're the defeated team. Yes, they already lost Madison attitude? Square Garden. Do you see their attitude? I mean, come on now. I saw it yesterday. It wasn't good. Yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't exactly. Good. You see, they're they're not making shots. They're, I mean, it's just they don't really have too much, too much of a chance, and I think that the story is written here. You know what? Indiana's gonna win. All right, like yeah, Indiana is gonna win. Indiana's gonna, gonna win. win. I and think David, simply if, because they're just a better basketball team. They're a better team. You watch the Knicks the play. Indiana Pacers are you a better are, team overall. The Knicks aren't playing bad defense. Let's let's put it at that f- to begin with. They're not but playing they're bad just defense. They're scoring so much. Who's Indiana playing scoring Pacers, so much? They yeah. so They're not scoring that much. Yeah, but they have people who can score more than one person. They have Paul George. They have uh, Grant uh, George. Yeah, Hill. but for they that, the Knicks Green. are they're, they're not playing bad defense. They're not. What's uh, killing what them happens, right what now? When you what's get to Miami? The reason why they're gonna lose Miami to Indiana? Miami doesn't play great defense. Who doesn't play great defense? Miami. Yes, they do. No, they're not gonna be able to stop three people who can score the way uh, those three people. Yeah, they can. can. They can. No, they can't. Shane Batty no, is can. a great defensive player. No, LeBron James was first team. And if all they defense. do, and if they do focus, if they do focus Dwayne on Wade those, if they do the focus on those okay. three people, mm-hmm. they could just uh, give it to Roy Hibbert or David West in the post, and it's game over from there. Roy Hibbert's uh, one of the tallest players in the NBA. He is. Uh, yeah, he is the tallest player. In no, the he's NBA. not. Uh, the beat. Oh, yeah, sure, sure, sure. He's one of the tallest. He is the tallest. The beat is the tallest. He's 7'3". Roy Hibbert's 7'2". I'm telling you. The the reason... I stumped him. I I got him already. This is a quick (laughs) win for Sam. It's usually not this quick. Point one Honestly, <laughs> we're going to just have to wait and see because I'm telling you right now, Miami's not going to lose against Indiana. I think they are. They're going to spread the floor. I think that people are... Uh, 
I think that you know people in the NBA are tired of hearing heat this, heat that, including Indiana Pacers, a small market team from Indiana who, who with a great basketball tradition that just gets overlooked year after year. They were a number two, number three seed, and I feel they're done with getting overlooked, and they're going to come in there with a lot of motivation, and they're going to take Miami by storm. And I think Miami's going to spread the floor. They're going to use their three-point Miami shooters. Miami lost mm-hmm. to the Bulls without Derrick Rose. Okay. A lot of teams lost to Chicago without Derrick Rose. Yeah, but Chicago without Derrick Rose is a worse team by far than an Indiana Pacers team. Yeah, they, com- yeah, like they, are. they are right now. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. Chicago, you can't compare Chicago so, and Indiana yeah. right now. So I that's but why I feel they're, Okay, they, they lost win. one game to Chicago so far. Yeah, exactly. They lost one game to Chicago. Like they okay. shouldn't have lost that game. That was the what was that? That was you the can, first. You, can, you gotta give them one. Come on, Chicago's game. not a bad team, even without Derrick Rose. Without Derrick Rose, they should like. And he's not gonna play in, in Game Five. So. Now I also look, look what Boston did without Rondo. They did. They uh. They uh. What they do? They uh. They went they, they, the series ended four two. Yeah. They went to. I know, but well, all right, Miami's gonna have to get used to that now because Rondo's never gonna be the same again with that ACL. He's not gonna have the quickness. He's not gonna have the speed that he used you to. You never before. know. He's not gonna. Have to have you've seen. We just saw last year. He's Adrian not, Peterson come back. If it's possible, Adrian, Adrian Peterson, different. we haven't seen Derrick Rose that's yet. Different. That's different. Adrian Peterson relies on, they just got a new tackle that year, right? They got the, okay. uh, the one of the best tackles in the league. Yes. Yeah, so they just got him, so they have excellent blocking. He, I mean, he used power for most of those, for most of those yards. He expressed power during most of the yards. Whereas Rondo... Oh, that's not true. Come on, we how, both know he used his speed on that one. Watch all of his highlights from what the past is, season. He outran everybody. If anything, he looked faster than Chris Johnson that year. He was faster, but he wasn't quicker. That's what I'm saying. Rondo's go- Rondo relies on his quickness, which is going to be hurt from an ACL injury. He's not going to be able to have yeah, those, he, quick, it will be hurt. Some, those quick side to side jabs that I feel like. He won't. Point, he won't be as explosive scoring. Good, I'll give you that. He won't. And think about the good def- the good uh, point guard uh, competition that he has in the East. He has Derrick Rose, Deron Williams, he has Kyrie Irving. He has some also then Derrick Rose won't be will come back as good either. You're saying he won't right? come back as good. He won't. Right. That's, he missed an entire year of basketball. Nobody comes back from an entire year of basketball besides Michael Jordan and Doug Jordan Curry. came back from missing what was it 69 like, games. And he year. and he scored was that was a year he scored sixty three in Boston I said. I said on besi- Larry Legend. I said besides Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan. I don't think it's impossible. F- for Derrick Rose, it is. Derrick Rose doesn't know Michael Jordan. So Jordan, so Michael the only player is Michael possible Jordan, for is Michael Jordan. Because yep. Michael Jordan had more than one tool he could use. He could drive in, and after that, yeah, after, Michael Jordan. Yeah, it's sure. When he come became on. older, he became a shooter. I mean, come on now. That's like he became more of an. Remember, this was only his shooter. sophomore season that this happened. Uh, who, Derrick Rose? You only no, this was Jordan. Jo- I'm talking about when he uh, when he went to baseball. Oh, no, I'm not talking about baseball. I'm talking about when he hurt his, uh, I think it was his ankle. Achilles. Ankle, right? Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, another series I want to talk to, uh, I want to talk about is San Antonio Golden State. Which I called that San Antonio is most likely going to win this series. They, they haven't saying. won yet, so yep. calm well, down. Well, they're up 3-2. <laughs> I mean, they're and up 3-2, and that's not really the most, like... That's, that's it's not two, dominant, but that's let's, two say, wins away. That's let's two. say they go back to Golden State and lose. You still have Game 7 in San Golden, Antonio. San Golden Antonio State, is one of the hardest places to Golden play in the NBA. Golden State can't win. I mean, can't lose at home. They can't lose at home. Do you know what? Okay. This is They're why too good at home. Golden State lost. They rely on Klay Thompson and Stephen Curry to the point that if they're shooting bad, yeah, they have, they have a great team. But Stephen Curry and Klay Thompson, the only thing they've really developed – I mean, Curry, he's developed the passing game. And but other than Lee. that, he hasn't, he's, they, they, both of them, they haven't developed anything about besides David three Lee, points. Bogut, you're forgetting mm-hmm. about Yeah, that's why players. the claim was, was close for a while. Yeah. That's why, that's why at one point and Spurs were only leading by two, why they tied it. Have you seen the energy in Golden State? The, the energy like was horrible yesterday. Oh, uh, they, wait. I wish we could watch this game around the energy. Look at right there. <laughs> Look at the energy. I mean... Come on, look at that's that. That's early in the game. Yeah, that's early. Come on. That's in the Spurs stadium. What are you talking okay. about? Okay. Look, at, look at their energy. I'm talking about the energy of the crowd in Golden State. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, that's what I'm you're talking about. I'm talking about the crowd factor like, in Golden you know, State. I thought you were talking about Warriors. I mean. No, that's why would I say that they can't lose at home and then mention energy of the team while they're I thought you were talking about their energy yesterday, right? Energy no, no, no. The energy at home. The, and if I was that, a Warriors fan, I'd be scared nuts. because they look tired. They just look tired. <laughs> those fans go nuts. I'm telling you, they I'm sorry. get a day off. 
Curry's what, 23 years old? And how long, how old is Clay Thompson? 22? I don't know. And, yeah, and they I looked guess. dead yesterday. Tony Parker, how, and Ginobili. How old is Ginobili? 30? Didn't he just turn 36? All I'm saying is... They're running the floor they faster than them. They can't lose... It's kind of sad. That's like if Myers was running faster than me. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm 16. Well, are you they saying can't lose That's that sad. <laughs> like, come on. Look at this. Just... Co- oh, my God. Wait, are you, are you assaulting Myers? <laughs> and his no, radio my, show. No, Myers. And saying that his radio See, show is garbage. Is obviously a better show than Myers. But anyways, well, let's not get into that. That's debatable. I think it's me and... Wait. But anyway, going back, is uh, you think Oklahoma City is going to come out of this in any, like, you think there's any chance that they I th- get I out think, of this? I think, yeah. Really? You yeah, think actually, that I don't, I don't, I, I would not be surprised. You wouldn't? I would be insanely surprised. You think if, so? Yeah, it's 3-1. to one. It's Memphis leading 3-1. to There's one. only been eight teams, right, that come back from a 3-1 lead? What? There's, there's yeah. I, I don't think teams. Oklahoma City can do it. I really don't. I think it's going to be Memphis winning that game. And it's going to be a good series against whatever team comes out of uh, the San Antonio Spurs Golden State. I can't argue on, with yeah. you on that one. Yeah. So, I mean, like... Honestly, I think who, I think from the Western Conference, Grizzlies are going to finals. Let's discuss, since uh, we pretty much just discussed the NBA playoffs, let's discuss teams that, we, that I think who didn't make the playoffs this year, I think who have a good chance of making it next year. Uh, Washington Cats. Wizards. I think... Wizards. Well, the Wizards are a good team, and they do... I, my problem with the Wizards is that they come out for big games. They beat yeah. They, they beat the they Heat. Beat they beat OKC. But they, they beat don't OKC. have that kind of same intensity against teams that they should beat against middle teams. I feel like yeah. they're that's a young, immature team. I think. Yeah, they're like, but that's. You know? I mean, they need to mature. So I get, think give them a couple more years. But I think the Cavs. They have Varejao. They have uh, Kyrie Irving. They have uh, what's that new kid that they got? The uh-huh. rookie. What's his name? Oh my. He's, he's good, too. Yeah, he's good. I forgot his They're name. They're going to be a really good team with those two guards and Varejo playing down. They could be dangerous. Yeah, and, yeah, and, yeah, you know, really I think good. they, they would have made the playoffs as long as Varejo didn't get hurt. Yeah, with the, with that long, uh, What healthy. happened to his lung? Oh, I, I forgot what happened. Like, he had to get surgery on that. He can play. But yeah. he was having an amazing... He was having an all-NBA yeah. first-team s- type season before he got if Varejo, injured. If Varejo plays next year, then the Cavs will be... Yeah, he will. Like... They, they announced at the beginning of the season that he'll be back next season. Yeah, so, I mean, they're going to be a dangerous team. They, they will be a dangerous they, team. They play, uh, they play in the same division as Chicago, right? Yeah. If I was Chicago, I'd be nervous. A little nervous. A lot We're nervous. getting Rose back. I'm going to be too scared. Yeah. Uh, so, so what? You're getting Rose back. You're getting an injured Rose You're getting... Back. Wh- you think you 2011 think Rose MVP. is going to be able to stick Kyrie Irving? <laughs> what? You think Rose is going to be able to stick Kyrie Irving? Yes. No, Kyrie oh Irving's my. Gonna, Kyrie Irving's going to make him look We're like We're talking Brandon about an MVP Knight. right here. Kyrie Irving's going to make him Call me when Kyrie gets an MVP. Kyrie's going to get one next year. No, he's not. Yeah, he will. Oh. Um, <laughs> I cannot believe you just it's, said that about Rose. Okay. I'm, I'm shocked. It's okay, Ricardo. Oh. Believe me. Believe me. You're kidding me. Oh. This is disrespectful. Man. Kyrie, Kyrie. That's disrespectful. That's so disrespectful. Chicago's not going to be. Chicago. Derrick, With Derrick Rose? Look, Derrick look, Rose look will, what they're doing Derrick right Rose now. Derrick Rose will yeah, not Yeah, they're going to get out right now, but. Derrick make, Rose will not be Making it to the second round of playoffs without your MVP. Kyrie's going to make Derrick Rose look like Brandon Knight. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's what's going to happen. You know what's the problem with the NBA nowadays? They celebrate players too much. Look at Blake Griffin. What has Blake Griffin and the Clippers done? Look how many commercials yeah. he has. Look! Look at Chris Paul. Yeah, I love Chris Paul. It's my, probably my favorite point guard ever. But really, what what have they done? They got out the first round. Yeah, and they I have know. an amazing team, and they, and they're getting commercials. But I mean, I commercials think, commercials are a player's option, and it's a good way for. But them you to know what? Money. I think I. Yeah. But that's the thing. You go back to the nineties. The only re- Jordan, had Jordan had commercials had because to- Jordan was Jordan. I mean, Come on. a lot of people had commercials in the nineties. Penny Hardaway had commercials in the nineties. Not not as not as much now. You go on almost any channel, you'll see a Blake Griffin or a Chris Paul no, commercial. No, I don't see him that often. I saw. I don't, I don't know how much TV you watch. I, I mean, I, 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 when I don't I'm don't watching TV, all I see is Blake Griffin and Chris Paul on my TV. That's maybe because you watch, uh, <laughs> I don't know what you watch. I don't know. I well, when I'm not watching ESPN, I'm watching Soap, so, and I still see it. I'm just morning. kidding. That's a joke. <laughs> 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 so, I mean, Kyrie Irving is going to be. Yeah, he, he's an amazing player. And uh, you know what else is And I think, I think in the future he could be top, the top Point guard in the NBA, you but know right now we haven't we haven't discussed it all. But Minnesota Timberwolves are gonna be really good. Oh my God! I Kevin Love, the, Ricky Rubio. You know Rubio. what it is? It's just Kevin Love is too soft. He's yeah. always getting injured. 
know. And it's frustrating. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm a Nets fan. But when I see a team like the Timberwolves get an injury like that, and when they have so much potential, it breaks my heart. Yeah. <laughs> I want to cry. Like, you have a gentle heart. They, they have so yeah. much potential. They really do. You have do. Ricky Rubio. You have Kevin Love. You have that whole team. That whole roster. The bench is not even bad. You have a great team there. That, now, that's the type of team that every you know every playoffs people think you know what's you know what's what team's not being looked at but you know they can make they can make a run. That's the type of team I thought they were gonna be in the playoffs and then Kevin Love got injured. And yeah. But before while we have you on the show, I also want to discuss one thing. Uh, Dwight Howard not si- if he does not sign with the Lakers, I think that the perfect match for him would be the Houston Rockets. You think, oh, I have that to agree be, with you. I have to agree with you. That would that be. One. They would be a nice team. They would him. be. I think. Jeremy, oh my God. you get Jeremy. <laughs> I think that's Lynn, a top James three Harden. seed. That's I think a, that's, that's a top three yeah, seed that's, in that's the Western competing. Conference. That's a no. no, no. Yeah. That's what? competing with. Okay, that, I think that's, that's number that's one. That's a finals. Seed. That's number one caliber seed. NBA team. That's, I think that's number one seed in the West. Easily, you get, you get Dwight Howard. Dwight Howard's not playing a bad season. People were, were you know, they were jumping on Howard because, yeah, yeah he didn't he play like injured, Howard, especially at the beginning like, of the season. But he still led the league in rebounds. He was still getting his blocks. Yeah. And yeah, he wasn't scoring as much. But towards the end of the season, he did his part. That's how they got to yeah, the playoffs. I mean, and yeah, they got so bad. It took Kobe, Kobe getting injured Kobe. to. To pump him up, like yeah. I mean, but you know what? I when think, it takes somebody I, you know getting I injured was? to do that. Look, Kobe, you know Kobe's gonna have the ball. It's Kobe, but yeah. Howard's. The, it's it's like when I look at it, it's kind of like the Melo and Stoudemire situation. I, I think that I've uh, oftentimes voiced my opinion on Mr. Stoudemire <laughs> and how I feel he should be traded. He, oh my God, to the Indiana Pacers, it would be beneficial to both teams. They'd finally get the star to lead their team, and the don't, Knicks don't would. Don't you think that's too big Knicks, though for the no, Pacers? No, but the Knicks would get. The Knicks? No, it's not too big. What, what do you mean too big? They, they already have their share of big men. I don't think they need Stoudemire. No, I'm saying David West for Stoudemire. Oh, that's you get a good David trade West, for the Knicks. That's a good trade David for the West, Knicks. David West, an anonymous star coming to the Knicks, doing his part, winning games. He could work well with Carmelo. I mean, that's just yeah. Sam that's just perfect. And, does have and we're gonna. There. I think we're gonna end on that note. I'm Sam the Man. That's Steven Chicas, my <laughs> son Ratchet <Ritchie. laughs> I'm not his son. He's my son. He's his son by a lot. Daddy loves. Daddy loves him. <laughs> All right, that's our show. Join us next time. Heat are winning the finals. Indiana Pacers. Pacers. Knicks. 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 Knicks.